right, we're resuming with some Phantasmagoria 2 tonight. Um, had a lot of fun doing it last time. Um, I was gonna say... <laughs> I was gonna say, uh... What a trip fucking last time was. And the game crashing. It's like Undertale style, and you had... Just the, the, the weird, like, bondage club, and... Ah! Man, it was something else, uh... Something else. Well... Uh, by the way, unrelated... Uh, there's been a lot of FV Fridays, man. I, I gotta say, like, it's been one of those things that isn't, like, the most uh, super exciting shit at times, but it's a very relaxing little, like, peak in the 90s, and I just love it. I just love doing FV Friday, because it's like, with Hardcore Friday, it's just like, it's suffering, but this I'm just like, I can chill back, I can enjoy a cold soda, I can get all comfy and just, mmm, it's good. It's good, boys. Anyway, let's see here. So, but I'll tell you what. When you're doing FME Friday stuff, it's just like a fucking, like, it's a trip. Because it's like it's borderline soft core porn. Sometimes it's just like violent 90s shit. <laughs> like, man, you don't, you never know what you get with this stuff. All right, anyway. You had it on the screen, all that stuff. Oh no. And I'm not talking about the game, but there's someone outside my door. For real, I'm not even making that up. Um. <laughs> uh. Okay. Well. No, we're good now. We're good now. All right, whatever. <clears throat> I dropped some frames. Okay, well, that don't matter. Anyway, we're back. We are back, and we're going to play some Phantasmagoria. <laughs> okay, hang on. Uh, I'm going to switch out the window here. All that stuff. Uh, uh, okay. Anyway. Uh, anyway, boys. Anyway, boys. Here we go. We're gonna continue previous game. We're gonna load the game. All right, y'all ready for some fantastic game? Yeah, Suey. The, the game that's totally opposite of that. <laughs> but all right, all right. So uh, where did we last leave off? Well, uh, none good. I would say <laughs> none good. Yeah, yeah. You wanna get down? Get down with the sickness. Girl. All right, well, welcome back. Welcome back. Last stream was a bit of a mind trip. I was at a sex club, and uh, I got pierced, and it was just disturbing. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, rip him a new one, detective. <laughs> she locks him up with Hannibal Lecter. Never reference what inspired you. Never reference something that's better. You know what I mean? It's like shitty B movie sci fi says, Yeah, dude, Star Wars. I'm like, uh oh. So, what is Phantasmagoria? Well, in this game, I don't know what it means, but in Phantasmagoria 1, it's like the show of. Um, I think it was like a show that um, this crusty old magic wizard performer did in this thing. And. Uh, from what I remember, at least. Alright, anyway. Welcome back to this. That's a disorienting mess. Um. Hmm? Uh. Bruh. Okay. The blood. <laughs> Sorry, dude, I sneezed. Oh, God. All right, well. Yo, rat. This blob. You killed him! <laughs> Okay, well, we did call everybody, like, last time, but I don't know if I can do that again. 
Uh, winter gear. Okay, did I have the passwords? I forget. I totally forgot. Sorry. Uh, anyway. Uh, anyway, let's see here. Well, I don't know what, what am I really doing this time. I, I don't know, man. Uh, Hmm. 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 I don't know if I'm supposed to do anything here. Maybe. Maybe I am. Maybe I'm not. Tell what. I should probably go on the telephone just in case again. Because they're obviously doing something here. Hmm. Red Skunga. Oh, yeah. Okay. L let me see. Let me see my list here of. of, of uh, 6125. I always forget the numbers. 6125. Mm, nothing. Or. Uh, Jesus Craig, don't be such a baby. Okay. Well, then we got me. Let's call myself and get a, like a demon on the line. Six, six, six. You know, I don't give a fuck about that hatred game, but when I initially saw it on YouTube, I was laughing my ass off because, you know, you blow up a nuclear power plant at the end of the game, like killing everybody, and you're supposed to put in a three-digit code at the end, and it's anything you want, really, but for the longest time, I thought the, the code was six, six, six. Okay, uh, Jocelyn... 6229. No, it was 6992. Sorry, my bad. Yeah, you did miss. You did miss Shenmue. Um, hmm. Someone else have my fucking door. Demons. Demons outside my fucking door. I think my neighbors are drunk and coming home at 3 a.m. actually, so they've been drinking. Cook, 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 cook. Alright, well. <laughs> okay. Yo, Bob. Dude, I'm just waiting for like them to rip up the door and be like, hey, well, I don't live here. What about Paul? I don't think the phone will do anything here. I, I think I sh should go around and talk to my co-workers, actually. Hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, man. Can you believe they dragged our butts into work today? Yeah. The sensitivity is overwhelming. It was almost worth it to see that cop chewing on Warner's set. Yeah, that was pretty damn cool, wasn't it? It's too bad she didn't pistol whip him. But <laughs> okay. Uh, all right. Um, uh, huh. Hey, bud. How was your second date with a mysterious J? Huh? What? <laughs> a dud. Big time. I mean, once I got past the sexy eyes... The Dude, this this Seinfeld episode bones, sucks ass. I saw the squid beneath the skin. Oh, what a drag. <laughs> You're telling me? He spent half the evening picking apart Bella Lugosi's <laughs> staring at his own bad self in the bathroom mirror. He doesn't like Bella? Mm -mm. I will piss on him then. <laughs> a lot of piss going on right now. Am I supposed to uh, click on Tra Travis's name? Travis. Uh. You know, I didn't feel a damn thing about Bob yesterday. But today I can't get the poor jerk out of my head. I keep seeing him splattered all over the walls. No wonder, bud. That was really nasty. So, um... You... Uh, Talk to anybody about it? 
Yeah, I went to this shrink yesterday. This game is really quiet. Did anybody else right now? I'm going to see her again today. Cool. Yes. Yeah, I'm going to turn it up. I'm going to turn it up for you. I can barely hear what they're saying, though. Alright. There, that should be a little bit better. <coughs> I have I seem to have exhausted all the dialogue things here. Hmm. Oh, everybody! Everybody's just at work again, so you know it's fine. It's fine. Hi, oh, it's gonna get awkward and weird. Hi. I sure had fun last night. Yeah. How about you? Yeah. What? Yeah, I did too. <laughs> <laughs> you don't think of me every time you feel those bruises. My god. Well, okay. Hmm. I don't know. So you guess it's exhaust all the dialogue options, but. <laughs> Therese? Demon! More. Jump scare! What? You want more? <laughs> But <laughs> what? 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 Okay? That was a fucking demon in my head. Think decaf, babe. <laughs> Watch out for her horny grip. Okay. Okay. <laughs> God, this game. Uh, what are we gonna do here? Uh, what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, uh, box is bleeding. Hmm. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Uh, well, maybe the water cooler. Not water cooler. Water tank. Oh, it is a cooler, right? That's what it's called. That's English. That was an important cutscene. Very, very vital. Can I keep doing this? Yep, very thirsty. Hey everybody, we never switched the games from Shenmue, so uh... <laughs> hey, stay hydrated everybody. Where's Hydrobot when we need him? Where the fuck is Hydrobot? Is Hydrobot dead? What happened to Hydrobot? Oh, oh, I drank all everything I could. Oh, okay. Huh, well, <laughs> died of thirst. Anything else I can do here? Well, can't really do this anymore. I'm not sure if I'm if I'm done here yet, but uh, hey, hi, Joss. Hello, Curtis. Listen, I am so sorry about being such a jerk yesterday. <laughs> I was pretty freaked out, I guess. We all were. It's okay. Bleh. This game is, is radiating a lot of uncomfortable atmosphere right now. I don't know. I can't put my finger on it. Bleh. Curtis. I um, tried to call you last night. I couldn't reach you. The phone just kept ringing and ringing. Sorry, I was having a sex with a sex demon. I'm sorry, Joss. I just... No, no. Don't apologize. You don't have to answer to me. Do whatever you want to do. I know. I Look, I just... I just unplugged the phone. I took a sleeping pill, okay? I, I just checked out for the night. All right? Maybe she knows. 
sorry for what? Mm. Uh oh. Well, that's that. Anything else? I wonder. Uh, talk to Travis. Uh, probably do something here. Huh? Sit your ass down. Hmm. Well, done all that. I guess I just got to check the uh, the stuff here. But what's my what was my, my password again? I I don't remember, man. Uh. Well, uh, what was my password? Fuck, uh, blob, right? Blob. Yeah, those. I think. Yeah, okay, there we go. Okay, check my emails here. Um, can't I can't concentrate on this? What? what? Uh, my high cholesterol problem. Oh, okay. <laughs> huh. I am your death. Uh oh. Uh oh. Bruh. Uh oh. Oh man. Axis. Energy. Curtis. Well, it's not the same thing, is it? No, I can't use it. No. Creepy man. Hmm. Hmm. Creepy man. What just happened? Stuff is going on. <laughs> what is happening? This is creepy. <laughs> Can't scroll down anymore, huh? Alright, well... Uh, employees, anything new here? Hmm, not sure if I missed anything. <laughs> Windows destruction. Alright, haunted TXT files. And then Mario popped out of the screen and sucked my dick. Alright. Yahoo! Let's -a go! Yahoo! Alright. Uh, well, a blob can help me out here. I'm, I'm sure I missed something on the computer here. I, I, I'm positive of it. Let's a blow! <laughs> Sorry. Oh, here we go. Can you believe this shit? Oh my god, I have so many emails. Jesus. There's an email that says, ooh. Wait, hang on. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, 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 okay. Mmm, <laughs> porn. Well. Ooh, yeah. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, I am still quivering inside from last night, aching and quivering. When I think of you, I can hardly sit still. Less. The cold porcelain, your hot mood, your sweat, your taste. Is. I thought you would be good, Curtis, but you were better than that. You were unbelievable. Best. Savage and sweet. Oh, God, I'm sweating. <laughs> Straight reply. Terry's, I had a good time too. <laughs> Can you believe this shit? Okay, I can't. Here we are, supposed to be working away the day after a brutal murder right in our office in your cube. All yeah, right, admittedly, it was the murder of a marginally human slug boy, but hey, it didn't serve that. Every time I think about it, I'm about to hurl for distance. Old man Warner has hit a new low with this one, don't you think? Funny reply. Go ahead and think about it, Trev. Practicing is the only way you'll be able to maintain your standing on the Olympic project projectile puking team. Go ahead and make me proud. <laughs> what? 
Okay, well. Funny. Ah, he died. He's dead. He. Okay. Did I miss anything here? Just in case, you know, just in case. Sarcastic reply. Well, she left. Mm. Maybe I gotta go somewhere else? Mm, did they all leave? Is my day over? No, not really. I'm gonna check the door here too, but I'm trying to trying to get back here. <laughs> oh well, I could sit down here, but again, I'm sure I missed something on the computer, man. Check the boss's door. Right, I'll try. It's kind of like it's can't really be reached right now. Hmm. Talk to her. I've done that. Maybe that had to. Nothing here. Unless well, it's another one of those button things, right? <laughs> oh, wait. I could just open up the door like that. I thought I was locked in there, man, but alright. Hmm. Hmm. Is anything new in here now? Oh, the hammer's here now! The hammer's here! Yeah, we needed a hammer for something last stream, right? Ah, uh, okay. That was what I was getting one guy at last stream, okay. Okay. Oh, they fixed it up, huh? The hell? Oh, man. It's been plastered over. Hmm. They're trying to hide something. They know. Well, shit. Well, I wonder if I can do this. No, okay. Oh my god. We needed we needed a hammer for something. What's like the, what was it again? Oh, the toolbox, right? The toolbox. If we can open this up right now. Well, I gotta do that at home actually. Okay, well. I've been here. Right, well, I guess you just head on home. Yeah, we can't go here yet. <laughs> Use hammer on head. They just go home in the middle of work. It's fine. You know, across town. It's fine. <laughs> We're gonna sit down. Here we go. Okay, I had to like switch the camera a little bit and then we do this. Hmm? Somber. No, 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 that's not what we wanted. That's not what we wanted. Can I combine this anyway? Oh, fuck, what am I doing, man? Um... I don't think that's it, guys. Hmm. Suggestions, guys. Use keys on hammer? Huh? Use keys on hammer? I don't think that's it. I don't think that's it. What was this again? It was just like a piece of plaster or something, right? I don't know. I guess a hammer and screwdriver? Try that. So if I look at this and then I go back, I suppose, and then I... Okay, now, now these items are combined and then I can... Oh, okay, gotcha. Quite bizarre, but all right. 
It's not really well explained you can combine items like that, but ah, whatever. What's going on? I guarantee some weird shit's coming in. What's this the thing I got? Uh, let's see here. The really must find not only is the military plug their funding on the threshold project, suggesting that there will be an FBI investigation on the methods of research. I have no other but to spend your threshold indefinitely. This is in 1976. What? Hmm. Odd. So the project, I expect you to handle the situation with discretion and tact. Frankly, Jones, I'm worried about you. You know, there will be a great sacrifice involving in gaining this great knowledge. I am like, getting a little tired of your torture conscious routine. You're in this, yes, as deep as the rest of us. You must remain calm and keep everything having to do with threshold in their strictest confidentiality. I would hate to have to lose you, Jonas. So that's the boss, huh? Jonas. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Go back to work now, I suppose, but uh, <laughs> necessary to show that. No, the paper is this, isn't it? Right? It's not the same. Fuck, I can't read. <laughs> Dear pesky plumbers, the Koopalings and I. Okay, so. Can you tell me what that was? It's from Bowser. The, the 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 cat in the, the hat the 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 fuck it I'll become a stripper Okay um. <laughs> Uh oh mail you got mail Examine this as is Okay well first we're gonna check this out see whatever it is A note saying, You're gonna die. Bridget's Books is proud to welcome best selling author Adrian Delaney. Ms. Delaney will be signing copies of her latest book, Coping with Loss. So, Adrian, wait, that's that's from Fantastic hmm. Margoria 1, right? Yeah, Adrian, I remember Adrian. Hey! Hey! That's the only connection to the first game. <laughs> okay. Continuity. That's probably the only tie-in into the original game. I guarantee you that. Adrian. <laughs> I guess. It's, I guess it's the same universe. I. I. I, I don't know. Okay. Uh. Well, can I go back? Can I go back to the club? I better hold off. I still have things to do. So we're going to Wintech. Hmm. Can I check with the boss? Hmm. A lot of security on this place, huh? But now that I did that, I don't know. Examine the letter? I uh, mean, like this? Uh. Oh, here we go. My dear Curtis, if you're reading this, I am dead. I have probably been dead for a very long time. My employees, Wintech Industries, will have arranged and carried out my murder. I know it's going to happen. I cannot avoid it. Before they come for me, I must confess to you, my only son. Oh, okay. Uh. Well. 
All right. Uh, Wintech has been experimented with forces I cannot possibly control. I am ashamed to admit that I've been an integral part of that process. You must understand, Curtis, how excited I was at the prospect of working on something of this magnitude. I felt it could be important, beneficial to the entire human race. And that's exactly why we made everyone into demons and skeletons, right? <sighs> it's the old story. <laughs> I was so immersed in the pure science of the thing that I started to forget my humanity. The threshold product is not itself on the evil thing, itself an evil thing, Curtis, but as long as it is in the hands of Paul Warner and Wintick, nothing good can come out of it. It is beyond the scope of their understanding, and they mean to use it for unspeakable purposes. They've done terrible things, Curtis. People have died. I've tried to quit Wintick to just to just take you away with me and Lee, but they won't let me. They have threatened your life, Curtis. I can barely live with myself now. No one are horrible. Horribly, this project has hurt you. I cannot risk losing your, you altogether. If I stay, they have promised to take care of you, and I give you the only be best schooling and medical care. I realize this is a pathetic attempt to repay you for the pain you have suffered at their hands, but I am in no position to bargain. I must accept. Forgive me. Forgive me. Huh. You're probably a man now, or very nearly a man. You have still been you have still been raised in the bosom of Wintick. A child of this monstrous corporation. I hope they haven't kind to you. But now you must leave here, Curtis. Get as far away from Wintick as you can. Live, love, enjoy life, and never think about them or me again. Huh. I love you, Curtis. I love you with all my heart. Be happy. So that would tie into the other letter, huh? Okay. So, that's my dad. So, what, what the fuck are they doing here? They're, like, experimenting with weird dimensions and demons? Or, man, I... Yeah. You and your dad basically worked for the UAC umbrella Ar Armacham Weyland Yutani. <laughs> yeah. It's just the, the generic kind of like bad company. Thanks, Dad. I get the hell out of here. You gotta do it. All right. Okay, uh, uh, so now what do we do once we read this? It's a bad company. Hmm. Well. Can't shake it with my boss either. <laughs> Wind take his EA. <laughs> well, you're back. Can't do nothing here, though. Can I interact with her somehow? Hey, check this letter out. <laughs> check out this weird shit that I have. Show people the letters. I maybe maybe I can try and show it to uh, Travis here. Hey, dude, check this out. Oh, guess not. Hey, check this hammer out. Definitely the hammer. Go to my computer. I, I yeah, I, I, I suppose. I want to see everything else though. I don't think I can though. Whatever. Mm, nothing here. Tra Trevor, 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 Travis or Trevor? I don't know why I keep calling him fucking Travis or Trevor. Oh, God damn it, man. Um, check, th check this thing out, man. Trevor Belmont. <laughs> Anything else can potentially do here? No, no we've been here. We've been here and done everything, too. Maybe show the letter to the psychiatrist, dude. I I have a I have a suspicion. If I do that, she's gonna get murdered by some horrible demon. Oh yeah, what am I thinking? It's not time for my appointment. Oh yeah, we go to the the restaurant. Oh, we're closed. Shit. Hmm. Have I talked to the rat today? No. I guess we can do that real quick. Rato. I can't interact with Rato, unfortunately. No, I can't do that. Alright, well, I'm kind of lost at this point. <laughs> hmm. There's nothing else. Is there anything else I can do? Something new? Murder without the mess. Huh? 
enter the revolting psyche of Curtis Craig? Hey! But the hell? Okay, uh, great. Hmm, it's getting weirder and weirder, man. Phantasmagoria. Okay, where haven't I been? I, the, the, the the bedroom? I don't know if that, anything's different here, but... Well, you saw something? I think. Oh, mirror, mirror. <laughs> yes, the mirror isn't real, but... Hyper-realistic blood! <sighs> what if our eyes aren't real? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was chili sauce. <laughs> Nothing here. Someone said use the hammer on the mirror, but I don't think I can do that yet. Is there anything else I can do here potentially? Yeah. Is the conspiracy his dad mentioning real, or is it, it, it just in the main character said? I don't know at this point. Huh. Well. Apparently you missed something at the boss's office. It's a note with passwords on it. Really? Yeah. Shit. Mega shit. <laughs> Man, this game looks so realistic. Look at these graphics. I know, dude. It's like I'm watching a movie. <laughs> I guess we're going back in, but I can't. So I missed something really important that is vital to me logging onto the computer and like doing something, or I'm not sure what I'm doing. But uh... <laughs> this will be graphics in 2013, dude. That's like future years, dude. What? Dude, you... can you guys imagine what 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 uh, what video game graphics is gonna look in 2005? What the fuck? It's gonna be more real than real life, man! Some Matrix shit! Matrix 2! <laughs> I like the, the ambient soundtrack in this game, at least. Okay. I can't just go through here. Okay. 2007 was crisis after all, dude. Seriously, I th I gotta ask you guys. Even even the t today does crisis still chug on hyper super mega graphics, or is it all fine now? Nah, yes, like I'm talking absolute ultra max super duper. <laughs> no, okay. It, it current yeah, and it works very well. Okay. It's mostly single threaded. Okay, well. Guys, I'm having a bit of a problem here. Uh, I I I'm having an episode. <laughs> I uh <laughs> This is my this is my cubicle, right? <laughs> Cuz <laughs> right? I don't think it is. This is my... No. This is Travis. This... <laughs> Where the fuck is mine? Where the fuck is... It's the third one, right? They all look the same. Oh, hang on. 
this this is mine. I know it's Trevor. I'm fucking making a joke. All right, now we're talking. Sorry, I I just got fucking confused there, man. Okay, so apparently I missed a big note. Can you believe this shit? <sighs> All right, are you implying that I have a delicate constitution, sir? I'll have you know that I'm a tough as a pig iron and hard as coffin nails. Now take it back, or I'll yarf on your shoe. <laughs> okay. Okay, so in order for us to get in here, um... <sighs> Yarf. Uh, here's the password. Infection. Uh-oh. Alright. Edward Gein. Subtle. Subtle. Hello, Ed. <laughs> mm-hmm. Very subtle, guys. Anyway, uh, I realized that you and a lot of security have been very busy over the past few weeks, but I'm afraid I'm going to have to make your life tougher still. I want to totally restrict access to the basement levels of Wintech, preventing entry to anyone and everyone but myself and to the threshold scientist. It simply wouldn't be safe to have employees venturing down there and possibly running to something and cause them harm. I realize that it will entail reprogramming the entire basement security systems, but I feel it's not worth it. I feel if it is worth it. If for some re if for some unknown reason someone who does not have clearance should <laughs> drunk ass neighbors outside the fucking door. <laughs> Alright, sorry about that. Uh, <clears throat> I realize I've well intended reprogramming the entire basement security system, but I feel it's worth it. If for some unknown reason someone that does not have clearance should get down to the basement, you are encouraged to use whatever means necessary to prevent their access to the fresh threshold room. Any method you deem, deem necessary, Ed, our future depends on it. Sincerely, Paul. Alright, what's, what's the one that says Carpe Diem? No, I think this is the last one. I miss it saying die. Desecration. Desecration. What a what a lovely name. This one must have been one that says Carpe Carpe Diem. Nope. Carpe Diem. Nope. The last one. Desecration. <laughs> All right, hello again, Ed. As my father used to say, there's an exception to every room. The exception to the restriction policy I just sent you is an employee named Curtis Craig. He is not to be allowed anywhere near the basement or the threshold. I want to make that perfectly clear. However, in the unlikely event that he should make his way down to the basement, he is not, he is not to be quieted in any, shall we say, permanent matter. Rather, he should be detained and Dr. Terrence Merrick should be called in immediately. Dr. Merrick will take Cur Curtis away to a safe place there he will no longer be a danger to himself or to us. Curtis is a special employee. I don't want him to be harmed anyway. Okay, well this must be car B D M. Are you guys sure? Car B with a space? Without a, and now without a space. Car B D M. Must be doing something wrong, man. Hmm. Do I have caps lock on? No, 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 no. Coop Terras. <laughs> hmm. Well, we, we tried desecration, which worked for this one, and this one worked too, but this maybe. Uh, did you use all three other passwords? It's case sensitive, you boob. Revelation. Huh? Right, it's Revelation, guys. That's what it is. Hello, Peter. <laughs> anyway, to Peter Sutcliffe. Okay. Hello, Peter. I was very excited to hear the news of strange and unusual energy fluctuations and thresholds. I hope, as you do, that this indicates increased activity and perhaps the impending success of the th synthesis attempts. Dr. Pokabalova has expressed concern, however, that the Wintech generators might not be able to withstand the stress of the additional activity. I want to assure you that I, it will be taken care of, and immediately, before a problem can arise, please arrange a meeting with Dr. Beleva. Little more baklava. 
and determine between the two of you <laughs> that the new equipment, what new equipment is required, and it will be immediately obtained. In the meantime, I trust that the, the threshold equipment is being monitored around the clock. Good luck, Paul. Okay. Now that we've done that, uh, I'm not sure what's gonna happen. Is it activated some sort of trigger? It'd be like, he read the name. Try to call them. Oh, oh, here we go. Duh. Don't even think about going over my head, Tom. Don't even think about it. You're losing it, Paul. Next meeting of the board, your head is gonna fly. Don't you threaten me. <laughs> you don't know what you're getting into. Oh, cut the dramatics, Paul. Your time here is up. You are a dead man, Rebel. Uh, you are a dead man, Craig. A dead man. What the fuck? Duh. Well, this sure is something. Oh, okay. Well, now, uh, <laughs> nurse, come on, nurse. What am I doing? Why am I here? I don't, I don't, I don't belong here. Shut up, wacko. Ooh. Chicken McNugget, nugget, nugget. <laughs> <laughs> well, I see I made it into the hospital. Uh... <laughs> the what now? <laughs> uh... <laughs> what the hell? Pizza, pizza, pizza! Yeah. Shit, it really is me. Where's my latex? Now I want to clock out of this discussion. Happy birthday, baby! <laughs> what, the fuck? what is happening? I got, I got. What is happening? Give me the Cheeto! I got, I got you! I got you! I got you! <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> Based Cheeto. <laughs> That's my baby. That's my baby. I got. I... <laughs> Why did he give this guy so many fucking lines? Oh, Joel. Disco dance. Disco dance. Disco dance. You guys, I found the best character in the game. I found the best goddamn character in the fucking game. What the hell, man? <laughs> Fruit, Loop. Fruit Loops and Cheerios! Take one. Have you been watching The Sims 4 stream, sir? <laughs> oh, God. You're gonna be okay? You're gonna be okay? Everybody in the pool! <laughs> what the f <laughs> what am I playing? Harabella Ponte went to. They gave this guy like 200 voice voice lines for some reason. That's my Barbie doll. That's my Barbie doll. Uh, okay, what the hell? How much record? Does he never run out of dialogue options? There's my taco salad. There's a. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, please. I love you. I love you, baby. <laughs> what the fuck is this? What the hell is this? What is happening? <laughs> Everything all right? Tasty bits of oats and chewy. 
this is this is this is this is where the game like up to this point I was like I'm taking this semi serious but now I'm just like dude every, all the bets are off Quiet in the back of the room Quiet in the back of the room Okay I want to see the uptakes here where he's just like what the fuck am I saying what the hell am I saying Oh 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 that's all the dialogue choices all right Where's my taco salad Yes. Well, I see the game's creators decided to put themselves in the game. No, sick. Sick and wrong. Things like that. <sighs> well, it's probably safe at this point. Uh, this game has taken a completely crazy turn, but all right. Well, freak, monster, I saw you, I saw you when they brought you in, I saw your guts. Okay. Abomination, mutant. Hey, you're from the freak. first game. I curse you with the black death. You're from the first game. That was the lady with the hat. For you, oh vile rat. Oh. <laughs> My vile and filthy blood for you. Drink me. Drink me. <laughs> I'm gonna drag you later. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I took all the, the I took all the energy out of that, but just I dispelled it. With Rom Zombie. I'm gonna drag you later. Okay. Let's see what else we have here. I believe I believe the lady here is actually uh what's her, what's her name? Sierra Lady. Fuck I'm blanking, I'm blanking. Help me out, guys. B -b 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 Help me out. Is that Roberta, Roberta Williams? Or is it name? Yeah. Sierra Legend. Yes. But that, that doesn't look like Roberta Williams. I see people saying that in chat, but me, I don't know. It's Lorelai Shannon, not Roberta Williams. It's Lorelai Shannon wrote Phantasmagoria. Okay, gotcha. I don't know. It became a... Sorry, this guy's saying taco salad ruined all those, like point and click games and I'm like what the fuck <laughs> the fuck did you all play Sierra games I have played police quest on stream before Roberta will Roberta worked on one and not two okay so here's the thing Roberta Williams worked on Phantasmagoria the sequel is uh uh Wednesday from 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 Adam's family <laughs> all right but give me the Red Bull okay hmm do you have any items? <laughs> I know, dude. Skirt, I got my bitches and stirred on my liches and skirt on my dishes on Dragular. Oh, here we go. Hey! Stop that right now or I'll have you sedated. I want to be sedated with the Game Boy. <laughs> Hey, you can't stop me. You can't make my fucking good beard. Okay, uh... <laughs> That's a desperate answer, like, oh, what do I do? Hmm, but there's something I can do with the nurse. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, she's from the first... Hey, 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 Oh. Okay. I don't have any items right now. Hmm. All the lead, you know. Hmm. 
Do I click on the ball? <laughs> no. Oh, I, I think, yeah, I think so. Hang on. No. No, 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 Damn it, Rob Zombie. No, 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 Maybe. <laughs> All right, well, let's get out of here. All right, well, bye-bye. No. So I gotta go now. Oh, no. No. So I'm just standing around for no reason. Uh, no. Oh, there we go. Jams. Black Mesa. I have to be punished. What? Where? Ah! It was all a dream. Hey, bud. You gonna live? Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. Yeah. This is ridiculous. I know, man. I this this, this fucking said. stream. I want you all to go home right now. Okay. <laughs> season one, season four, season one finale. Well, if you watch the real one, you you know. Tom's right, Curtis. You better run now. You're out of your depth. You look terrible, Curtis. Oh. Go home and get some sleep. Okay. Alright, later, Bill Murray. It's Demon. Pokemon Demon. Yeah, scared. Okay. Let's head on home. This apartment makes me sick. I, I don't know about you guys. This is a totally random, unrelated rant, but I know they intentionally like painted this green to be like kind of sickly looking. But if there's one thing that makes me like uncomfortable, it's old timey paintings with like old frames like this. Whenever you go into a house with like old, old bookshelves that are like old. Not maple tree, but like that very brown kind of tree, and there's old frames like this. It just makes it like, I'm like, ugh, grandma. Yeah, it's so like run down looking. Yeah, exactly. Now I wonder if I can do this now. No, I can't. Okay. <laughs> they need an interior designer. Listen, we need. I need to contact. Uh, what's his name? Tay Zonde. <laughs> Tay Zonde. What the fuck? The guy with the spiky hair. You guys remember that show? Extreme Make. Uh, Extreme Home Makeover. Move that bus. Move that bus. What's his name? Not Tayson, they fuck. Uh, Thai guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Thai, Thai, Thai Pennington. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Move that bus. Not fucking Tayson, they. What the hell? <laughs> Tayson, extreme home makeover. Move that bus. Move bus moves. It's just a big, big chocolate house. Chocolate house. <laughs> some, some stage. <laughs> Chocolate bus. <laughs> I think I'm, I'm I'm turning as squirrel poopy as this game is turning. Oh my god, it's rubbing off on me. All right. Uh, <laughs> what the hell is wrong with me, man? Okay. Nothing in here still. Okay. Jeremy and I was talking about before we started Halo Breach. We were talking about like we were just we were just like out of it that that night, and we're like, dude, this is gonna turn into a Tayson Day stream. Where you know, I, I asked Jeremy, has Jeremy seen? I asked him, you know, have you seen the Tayson Day video where he's playing Team Fortress Two? 
and Taizonde doesn't know like he's talking over himself through his stream. His stream audio is still going in the background. It's just like, you know, it's Taizonde, 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 Taizonde. And it just starts stacking. And if you want to know what, what some of the jokes I do on stream with the stream overlapping itself, I mean, going, ah, that's, that's inspired by Taizonde's hilarious stream. Oh, here we go. Ratu. Hey, girl. Rats are so much better than people. No, you're the only one I can really count on. How touching, freak boy. But Ratu, we're my friend. <sighs> Relax, Craig. It's only Blob. The only thing that loves you. Oh my god. Maybe the rat was behind it all along. Is it the same voice actor as the rat asylum lady? It probably is. Okay. Is now when I smash the mirror with the hammer? Nope. Hmm. <laughs> What's the name of the rat actor? Now, are you saying like the, the, the rat actor in the hospital? Or are you saying like, what the fuck is the rat called? <laughs> the rat actor. Rat Johnson. Okay. Try to go back to wind tech now. I don't know. <laughs> Stuart Little. Hmm. Still can't do anything here. I can't just hammer it open now. Hmm. I wonder what I should do now. And I can't get in here. Can I just smash the fucking glass open now? Go to sleep? Yeah, but the game doesn't really have like a go to sleep thing, you know? Can I go to my hot? No. Can I go to the, the weird sex club? No. I can't. Can I go to the restaurant? Oh, yes, I can. Yes, I can. Hey. Hey. Soup. Hey, Trev, what's with the shake? Aren't you worried about your tiny waistline there? Just drowning my sorrows, bud. In a milkshake? Yeah, I admit it. I'm uh, feeling some delayed nerves about poor old Bob. Oh. Yeah. <clears throat> I got kind of freaked out this afternoon myself. Oh, God, it was just so weird sitting there, you know? Right where he got splattered. Long time viewer. Hey, hello. Uh, Shadow Man was one of my favorite games of all time, and you mentioned, you mentioned playing it. And once you mentioned playing it, uh, have you ever considered it since then? I was actually considered playing um, Shadow Man for N64. It went also like funny. Back in the year like 2000 when that game was released, I thought it was like the most hardcore dark game ever. So me and my friend would put on the like, Swedish folk tunes while playing it. Because we were like, we were shit posting in the year 2000s. We were, I don't know how old that we were, but we, we thought it was funny to put on like songs about trailer trucks and like RVs while we were playing Shadow Man. Because we were like, this is such a contrast. We we're like, ha 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 ha. So, like, I was doing the shit I do now on stream, like, literally like fucking, you know, 20 years ago. <laughs> you know, crazy. Um, you know. Anyway. Proto shit posting. Am I thinking of the right game, Shadow Man? Like the ball guy with the skull on his chest, and he's holding a skull towards the 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 the, the, the screen. Yeah, that is Shadow Man. Okay, oh, yep, yeah, yeah, I played Shadow Man like way fucking back in the day. I don't remember much about it, but you know. I think I'm a big potato. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> you remember my uh, my aunt Emily? The one that lives uh, in Arizona, out in the desert. And the one that likes the animals. Yeah, that's the one. 
She, uh, she always tosses her, her dinner leftovers outside for the, the poor little woodland creatures, you know? Woodland? Yeah, I thought she lived in the desert. Shut up, my story. <laughs> so anyway, one, one time when I was there, she hauls back and she tosses this old mangy, big yucky baked potato outside. And it was beautiful, man. I mean, that woman has an arm like a pro ball player. And that spud just arced through the air until this sweet little bunny rabbit came hopping out of the bushes right into the path of destruction. No way. Way, afraid <laughs> so. And that tater hit Mr. Bunny right between the ears. I was trying to make a game here. It looked like a little a shooting right now. human help. I've never seen a bunny rabbit jump that high in my life. You think that's funny? That poor rabbit is probably in therapy right now. <laughs> was, was that scripted? <laughs> story was, was that the same improv? It reminds me of, you know, planes, trains, and automobiles? You know that scene where uh, John Candy and um, Steve Martin, they're, they're sitting in the hotel room, and I swear to God, it's not, like, scripted. They're just sitting there, like, laughing at shit and, like, drinking, and I, 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 it takes me out of the movie. It's very specific. You, you know what I'm talking about? They're at the hotel, and it's it's past the point where, like, you know, John Candy is put, because he's like, Yo, you know, but you, you can stay the night in my hotel room and all that. And they're eating, like, chocolate and drinking. And they, like, go off script, and they, like, don't act like the characters. It's really bizarre. It's very specific. And after that scene, it's, like, back to something, you know. I, I don't know. It's whatever. Trev, seriously, um, have you ever had really horrible thoughts? School of the thoughts. Like what? Like wanting to kill someone? <laughs> Trev, I wanted to kill Bob. Every time he laughed at me, I just wanted to fucking kill him. <laughs> Damn. Hello. Yeah. Everybody feels that way once in a while, man. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Damn. Dropping F F bombs here. Yeah, right, weren't they just like drunk? Uh, yeah, I guess, but like yeah, I don't know. Alright. Hey listen, man, I gotta go. I've uh, I've got a date for dinner. Someone new? Well, tell me about No, okay. His name's Mike, and um, <laughs> I met him at the pre-Raphaelite exhibit downtown. And he's smart and funny and cuter than hell. That's great. Yeah. Well, yeah. have a good time. I'm going to try. <laughs> and he can read. <laughs> Well, I'm going back to WinTech. Why shouldn't I just be going back home? I'm always exhausting options to like. I guess we're going. Well, actually, the therapist, maybe. Okay, on. Let me go and go to the. This. It worked. What a waste of a milkshake, man. Hello, Curtis. How are you? I'm okay, Doc. <clears throat> no, I can't help you if you lie to me. Fine. I think I'm losing my goddamn mind. <laughs> I know that feeling. Seat. Let's talk. Okay, well, uh, hey, yo, check, check this out. I found this letter that my father left me. Listen to this. The Threshold Project is not in itself an evil thing, Curtis. But as long as it is in the hands of Paul Warner and Wintech, nothing good can come of it. It is beyond the scope. Jesus, Doctor, does this sound like a crazy man wrote this? I don't think so, Curtis. It sounds perfectly rational to me. You're lying! Alright, somebody said that they need to do the Batman thing now? Let's try that. Batman. Um, and I gotta click this or whatever. 
I, I forgot what the instruction was. The wallet. Use it on your wallet. It's in the next appointment. Oh, okay. The hammer. Bum 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 better dum bum bum better dum bum bum better bum 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 bum. <clears throat> All right. Let's see. Doctor, I think I might have killed Bob. Uh oh. I don't remember doing it, but I can't get the idea out of my head. I, I hated him. I wished he were dead so many times. Well, that's highly unlikely, Curtis. Homicidal blackouts are extremely rare. Have faith in yourself. Do you really think that you could do something like that? Maybe. Please don't kill me. <laughs> well, now. Well, we are just doing a lot of progress here, huh? Doctor, why did you want me to come back again today? That's not your standard policy, is it? No. No, it isn't, Curtis, but I can tell that we have a lot of work to do together. And I wanted to get the groundwork done right away. Is that all right? No, no, no. I'm your friend. That's why I charge 800 bucks a session. D you know, I'm just trying to make a lot of progress and be friendly, you know. My mother's hatred for me went... went way beyond humiliation and hitting. She, um... She tortured me. She did things to me that, um... Uh, you hear about happening in Chile and Nicaragua. How did she torture you, Curtis? Curtis! How much do you think that wig cost it? Come monster. What's under that crawling, slimy skin of yours? It's all right, Curtis. It's over now. She's gone. You survived it. You're here, Curtis. <clears throat> well, this is getting, as they say, weird as fuck. Doctor, I think that this threshold project, whatever it was, got shut down a long time ago, but I think it's been reopened now. In fact, I think it's back in full swing. What makes you think that? A whole lot of little things. Files I've seen, conversations I've overheard. I think it's bad, Doctor. I think it's something that no one has ever tried to do before. Now, be sure you keep the difference between imagination and evidence clear in your mind, all right? Oh, you think I've been watching too much X-Files. Hey, everybody, it's the 90s. You know what's popular in the 90s? Orbits. Yu-Gi-Oh! Big Files. Check them out, Pringles. <laughs> Okay. Hey, you guys remember when Jack Black was uh, was an X Files, uh, and it was like Electricity Man. <laughs> you know, you know how fucking frustrating it was for me to like watch that episode. I, w I was watching with my parents, and uh, it's one of those like Monsters of the Week episodes, like a season two or something like that, right? And like immediately, like I saw Jack Black, and I'm like, I said, I was like, what the fuck? That's Jack Black. And my parents were like, who? I'm like, no, fucking Jack Black. And they're like, who is that? And I'm like, fucking. Ah! You don't know who he was? And I'm like, dude, that, that's like the saying, like, you know, I, I don't know what the equivalent would be, but it's like Arnold before he was famous, shit like that. You know, I was like, what? Oh, man! All right. Key. Baton. On this date with Therese last night, I got my navel pierced. This S and M club on stage in front of a room full of people. Is that something that you wanted to do? I don't. I don't think so. I. I don't know. I just. 
I just wanted to be controlled at the moment, you know? I wanted Therese to do things to me. <laughs> but when it was over, my feelings totally reversed. I, I wanted to control her. How exactly did you want to control her? Weird. I... Yeah, you guys remember uh, where the guy yeah, ranted about the taco salad? There and, um, I do. I just, I just pounced on her, and I, I picked her up, and I I'm a Cheeto. The bathroom, and we just did it. <laughs> we just did it like a couple of animals. And how did she react to that? She absolutely loved it. <laughs> I thought she was gonna break me in half. Curtis. Facade, 2005. Did you ever consider that maybe she was the one in control of everything? No. Uh, but you're probably right. Wow. Things sure are happening. Mm, maybe I'm liking some sort of... Oh, I'm not. Uh, I had this experience with my coworker, Therese. The sex was savage. <laughs> Consensual? You know, <laughs> nowadays, yeah. lingo means something different. The doctor, she brought out feelings in me that were frightening. I mean, wild, almost violent feelings. I felt like anything I wanted to do to her, anything I could dish out, she could take it. <laughs> Sorry, I, I, I used to man that fucking wasp guy right now. I fuck like a beast. <laughs> Alright. Wasp. <laughs> Let's see if I. I'm gonna exhaust. It should probably save actually before we do this, just in case we have a a problem. <clears throat> this is gonna sound really twisted, but sometimes I wish I could just live with Jocelyn and Trevor both. But you know, somewhere far away where no one would judge us and we wouldn't have to see another person. Moon. Many people have fantasies like that, Curtis. Just because it isn't standard behavior in our society doesn't make it wrong. Well. After my f mother started hating me, I, uh, my father got so weird. I know this game is pretty weird. He sort of withdrew and he just kept looking at me with those sad sad eyes did he protect you from your mother's irrational rages he tried not hard enough oh she hurt me oh she hurt me so bad Man, you know, it's kind of weird because it's like this This game is really dark with things. It's like weird, like, you know, it's like sex stuff and it's like dark, creepy shit, right? But then it's like, I'm a Cheeto. Here's a $2 wig we put on an actor. Like, there's a bit of a like, dissonance, you know what I mean? Like, th this could have been better than what it is, you know what I mean? Taco salad, you know. I wish it was like a little more subtle, I guess. I guess, sh I don't know. Don't, don't be so outright like, I don't know. It's I don't know what I'm trying to fucking say. <sighs> well, I think that's all of the, uh, the things here. Uh, the wallet, done that. 
I think that's all of them. Thanks. That's my sesh today. Yeah, I suppose that's it. Oh! Tell me the truth, Doctor. Does insanity run in families? Yes, it can, Curtis. But that sort of mental illness is generally a uh, chemical imbalance, and, and it's very, very treatable. Oh, God. Oh, God, maybe I've always been crazy. I mean, I can't, I can't remember big chunks of my childhood. And... You're upsetting yourself, Chris. Oh, Just God. try to relax and take a deep breath. You've got to stop it or I will. I'll kill you, you son of a bitch. After my father was murdered. Oh, my God, I, I never saw him dead before. But after they hit him with the car, they got out and they shot him. Landy. Wait. Oh my god, they shot him. Curtis. A suppressed trauma like this can cause such great emotional problems. I think you'll start improving now. Oh. I think we made some wonderful progress today, Curtis. Um, I'd like to see you again next week, but please don't hesitate to call if you need to talk, okay? I will. Thank you, Doctor. Uh-huh. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Pick up the phone. Yeah. Yep, yeah. yeah. that, that's what I was fucking... Oh, well. In today's session with Curtis okay. Craig, I determined that the patient was delusional, possibly paranoid, with the potential for violence. See, when Phantasmagoria 2 is at its best, it's just about Curtis's mental deterioration. Like when it's just when it's just him saying, Am I fucking crazy? That's what I like about this game. That is what's generally like horrible. I like horror like for me. That's what I really like about this game. It's like when it's just him questioning his his sanity, that's the best. That's the best. But when it's also like you know, smearing shit on the walls, then I'm like, ugh, ugh, you know. Anyway. What the fuck? Who's there? <laughs> Therese? Uh oh. How did you get in? I'm a woman of many talents. Would you play at Oblivion too? Curtis, come sit down with me. Have you been here long? Long enough to get to know your rat. What? She's a real sweetie. Thanks. <sighs> Neat. Don't... Don't hurt my rat. You know, you really startled me when I first came in. That was the idea, Curtis. Do you break into people's apartments often? No. Only when I really like them. Patrice, I don't want to be rude, but what are you doing here? <laughs> well... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I didn't come here to talk. Well, what did you come here to do? Jenga. Uno. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh! Hello, hello! This, what the fuck? What, what the fuck? I'm sorry. I need I need a beer for this. Hello, what? What the fuck? Did, I'm sorry. Why am I in the fuck, 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 fuck swing now? Don't 
like a freak only stronger regular you wanna feel the demon feel it now wanna get down in the alligator bayou and feel a day man I know how we can solve this Don't worry. You know, just you, just as an emergency, you know. Just as an em emergency. I want to see. Well, I'm just I'm just getting ready just just in case this gets a little spicy. But I'm sure there won't be any more. I'm sure it won't be any spicy. All right. Well, I'm I'm ready to rock and roll. I I guess. Oh God, what am I getting myself into, man? This is getting kind of intense, Trace. <laughs> oh no. We're not even close. Batman's ass! Very good boy. I whoop Batman's ass! I whoop Batman's ass! Well, that was the weirdest fan fiction I've ever written. What the fuck? Damn. Dirty lyrics you're writing up. Being of all employees under his management. There. And Joel is the worst streamer on Twitch. All he did was play Wesley Willis on stream and make dumb jokes that nobody laughed at. There's no music. Oh, oh. <laughs> I ass. No. <laughs> Guys, what's happening? Oh no. Who? Who was it? I'm, I'm not at liberty to say, Mr. Craig. God damn it, who? Batman. <coughs> who was it? It was Tom. Tom Ravel. Oh. <sighs> A moat. Put a shirt on. Where were you last night, Craig? Well, I don't know, Batman. Too, detective. Come on in. <sighs> well. Okay. Hey, you know what this reminds me of? The only reason I had this on my desktop is I really wanted to play Ricardo Milos during the sex scene and I wanted him to like dance around and be like You got that schooly bag do gab do school you got that do little dab you know but I didn't have a use for it so I just kept playing fucking you know Batman got on my nerves So you know multi joke <laughs> Anyway <laughs> This is a shitty stream tonight 
What were you doing last night between the hours of 8 p.m. and midnight? I was here. Streaming video games. With Therese Banning. Really? How late did she stay? I don't know. Late. I... Hmm? Uh, I, um... Went, went to bed, and, and when I woke up, she was gone. Where is she now? I don't know. I... I'm, so, I'm sorry? Craig. I said, where is she now? I don't know. She probably went home. I, I, I don't know where she lives. <laughs> hey, you look above you. There, there might, there might be like some video drum shit happening. Like, I don't know. I expect like teeth gun to appear any moment now. All hail the new flesh. Why don't you know where your girlfriend lives, Mr. Craig? She's not my girlfriend. Oh, really? <laughs> you two must be pretty good friends, then. <laughs> Not my girlfriend! Jeez! Mr. Craig, do you know of anyone who hated Tom Ravel? Tom had a huge fight with Paul Warner yesterday. It got to the point where they were screaming in each other's faces. I can't get over the really? scratch marks on my body. About what? About you, detective. And about Warner making us come into work the day after Bob was killed. Hmm. I don't know why, but I fully expect, like, whatever's up in the ceiling to be Batman bursting through the fucking ceiling and, like, <laughs> snapping her fucking neck. You know what, Craig? I think there's something badly wrong with you. What? I'd love to haul your psycho ass in, but unfortunately, I don't have enough evidence. Yet. Christ, you're screwed up. If you're guilty, Craig, I'll find you. No matter where you are, Bat no matter how big a rock you crawl under. I whooped Bat Okay. Do you hear me? Damn. <laughs> I got a I got a loose cat in the ceiling. Damn. By the love of God, stop with the shit music. I know that this is a legitimate one guy thing, but just to spite that person in chat, I'm gonna crank up the fucking Wesley Willis. 500,000%. You doomed us all. I can't do this yet. Um... <laughs> Imagine, imagine having such shitty taste you call West Lavilla's bad music. <laughs> okay. <sighs> Not a worry. No, no more, no more music. It's a serious stream. It's a serious stream, and we are serious, serious on this channel. No fun allowed. All right. I come here. I come here for serious, serious gameplay, and I think it's stupid of you, Joel, to 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 do these jokes. In fact, you're ruining the stream with your dumb, dumb comedy or quote unquote comedy. You're you're so unfunny, Joel. Stupid as fuck, shithead streamer. Dumb EU shit. I sure wish I knew what the hell was going on, Blob. Sorry. Yeah, you're a beautiful rat. <clears throat> hey, what are you chewing on, Blob? Uh-oh. Want some? <laughs> That's adorable. They smear like honey on like a fake plastic heart and be like, "Hey, get the get the rat to eat it." <laughs> All right, you listen to me. 
I know Blob can't talk. And she never did anything to anyone, so you leave her alone! Hmm. Yeah. Screw that demon. Creative uses for a staple gun? Hmm. Pulping heads made easy? God damn you! Ow, my this hand! Isn't real. Ow! You know, I don't know why, but I'm always reminded of, like, whenever whenever people are angry and they they punch furniture or walls, I'm always reminded of that one British kid who, like, played Call of Duty, and he's like... It's like he drank a glass of milk, and he's like, I'm so fucking upset! And he punches the wall. You know what video I'm talking about? <laughs> Yo, I'm ever going to be willing to try I Have No Mouth on my screen. Uh, I've said this before, but this, this... Out of all the horror games that I legitimately feel uncomfortable streaming, I have no mouth and I want to, and I must scream is a game that I don't think is appropriate to stream. This is a lot of shit in that game that I don't think is like, you know, not not my kind of jam, you know. But you're more than welcome to play it yourself. I don't know, it's just not like good stream material. Hmm, I guess just go to work here. Wait a minute, I have my mail! <sighs> you got mail. Well, we got, let's check it out. Meet me at the borderline tonight. Oh no. This time we'll go full circle. Do you dare, Curtis? What? No, 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 please, no, God, no. Alright, guys, cue up the Wesley Willis machine. We're going in again. Dear Curtis, I hate you. What? You killed me. Your very existence was so unnatural and repulsive that it drove me to my grave. I should have killed you when I had the chance. I'm coming for you, and this time, I'm taking you with me. Hmm? Uh... Huh. Well... It's getting kind of folk and creepy now. Um, Alright, well... And I can't immediately go to Borderline, can I? Nope, I gotta go to work. Alright. Hello, boys. Dude, what the fuck is up with that detective? purely unbelievable. What do you think you're doing here? Uh, I work here, Detective. I'm not trespassing. I, I just happened to leave some notes on Tom's desk. That's a load of shit, Craig. <laughs> you're not just a creep. You're a really bad liar. Now tell me what the hell you're doing here before I arrest you. Fine. What a great detective. I'm trying to find out who killed Bob and Tom. My ass. Get out of here, now. Look, Detective, there's some kind of company conspiracy behind all this. I think Wintech is is experimenting on its employees with hallucinogenic drugs. I think they've Do go on. It all sounds perfectly logical to me. You're a real case, you know that? You make Charles Manson sound reasonable. <laughs> Detective, you have to listen to me. I don't have to listen to Dick. <laughs> if I find one shred of evidence on Ravel, if I find one of your hands. One of your goddamn cells. Now she sure is acting. Dick you ass. Dare, stupid. I mean, the company murdered my father. They probably killed Bob and Tom. I mean, what, what do you want to bet I'm next? 
I won't say it again. Get out. Or would you rather I call the boys with the white coats and the butterfly nets? Come back, Curtis. You know you're longing for the sting of the needle, the burn of the electrodes on your skin. Hmm. Fucking demon back here. Uh, I was gonna say, dude, she was talking too fast, but I was gonna squeeze on a Kong Pao joke there when she said, my ass, what do you get when you cross a, an owl, the bungee cord? My ass. So I've been drinking these ciders tonight and they're delicious. Alright. Hmm, is this still taped up? I'm guessing so. Ah, Nothing here, I guess. What brand? No, no brands you guys would recognize. Unless you're Swedish. Can't go to the boss's office either right now. Can't go here either. And there's no way I can go back. Nope. Hang on. Get some water at least? Oh, you ballsy motherfucker, man. Okay, well. I really shouldn't be here, but guess what? What, what if she works for Wintech? Maybe she is the demon. Maybe she is going to do that. Hey, man, what's popping? Hey. Got enough calories there to power a small starship. Must be pretty bummed, huh? Yeah. I like Tom a lot. I really did. I know, I did too. Curtis, look, can we just... Cut the bowl for a minute and talk, okay? Okay. I think you need to get out of town for a while. I mean, you're, you're obviously freaked by everything that's happened, and Curtis, I know that cop has you down as a suspect. I think you need to be gone before the next one. The next, what, murder? What makes you think there's gonna be another one? I don't know. Call it Spidey Sense. I appreciate the thoughts, Fred, but I can't go anywhere right now. Look, I have to find out the truth about WinTech and this threshold project. Curtis, look. Everybody's heard rumors about about this threshold. I mean, it's a company urban legend, but okay, maybe it was bad, really bad, but it has nothing to do with what's happening now. I think it does, Trev. I think it has everything to do with it. <sighs> All right. All right, Curtis, look. If you have to do this, I'll help you. I'll hack into the net from home and see what I can find out. <laughs> I'm in. Thanks. <laughs> so, how was your date with what's his name last night? His name is Mike, you Philistine. And it was Mode awesome. change. Indian food, candlelight, reservoir dogs on laser discs. Watch reservoir dogs on your first date? Hey guys, it's the 90s, everybody. And we laughed at all the same places. Oh, sounds like true. Let's go on the internet. It's new. Just don't go on any cross country killing sprees, okay? Hey guys, let's rent some movies from Blockbuster. <laughs> Netflix. What, they mail you movies? <laughs> Sorry. Look, Curtis. 
We'll uncover the dark secret of the terrible threshold, and then you go somewhere and veg out in the sun, okay? <laughs> yeah, that sounds pretty good. Curtis, I just, I just want you to know that I'm your friend. Always. No matter what. So, here, why don't you finish this off before a stiff breeze blows you away there, scarecrow boy. Well. Oh, man. Are you salting ice cream? What the fuck? Wait, wait, what? I thought I was eating like a banana split. Did you fucking put salt and pepper on a banana? What? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, okay. Did you guys know that there is a uh, secret cutscene in this game? You know? If you press uh, the Q on Q three times on Trevor during the intro of the game, you get this like radical cutscene. I'll put it up on YouTube. I'll put it up on YouTube. You might... You might not know about this, but uh, it's it's pretty it's pretty crazy actually. But yeah, Trevor Trevor has this hidden cutscene, and it's basically the descent to madness that starts before you even like play the game. Uh, check it out. This side is great. Some sausages. Would you like some sausage? Would you like some sausages? I do. A. All right. Jokes are over. Okay, I gotta go with my 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 therapist or no. I got things to do. Then they can't go there. Bet some. Uh... Did you go? Did you guys know that um, Dilbert's theme song is actually from an Oingo Boingo demo called The Forbidden Zone? I love Oingo Boingo, it's one of my favorite bands. Hey, get out of here! Get out of here! Fuck out of here! Eh. This sounds weird, but like. I really like Oingo Boingo, but I kind of just really like their first album, even though, like, it's weird. Like, I, you know, everybody knows Weird Science and all these songs, but for me, like, Oingo Boingo, their first album is like lightning in a fucking bottle, but that's not the song, that, or rather, that's not the album people really like, but my god. Nasty habits. Nothing to fear is good. Yeah, no, no, the other albums are great, but. You know, <sighs> no one lives forever. Uh, da -da 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 All right, well, all right, all right. I guess I can do nothing but go home. It's going going home. Huh? Don't go in the fucking basement. Yeah. Doongy. Oh, here we go. Uh oh.
Raiden Fatality You win And then I shot lightning out of my eyes I must consult with the Elder Gods Okay Can I now break this? <laughs> Well, that was that was something. Okay. Oh, something new here. These are absolute the the, the the developers of this game. There's absolutely no fucking idea. Or that that's them. That's definitely them. The eyes of a gamer. No blobs aren't saying anything. Okay, well, uh, well, that wasn't it, was it? I still have things to do. I'll shoot more lightning out of my eyes. All right. Hmm. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do the business card on the phone. What? The business card on the phone. Hmm? Not sure what you mean. Uh, who will be the best? Who will be the be the highlight 2019 guest? Oh, oh, yeah, it'll be Charles Martin. I contacted him yesterday, and he said, "Okay, I will do it." Um, so, no. I'm just kidding. It's chills. It's chills this year. What's going on? It's me, Chills. Tonight we're gonna be playing Phantorsmaboria 2. In this game, you play as Jarvis. As Rosa Linda comes over and puts you in a sex swing. Something happened there, but I guess not. Anything new here? No, same, same old, same old. Uh. Okay. Uh. Therapist business card plus phone. All right, you got it. Uh. From this angle, or what's her business uh, thing again? It's. Uh, Oh, okay, that's very specific. Very, very specific. Dr. Ricky Harburg's office, how may I help you? Yeah, hi. Um, this is Curtis Craig calling, and I was, I was wondering if I could see Dr. Harburg today. I'm, um, I'm, I'm having a few problems. Now, let me see. The doctor's pretty busy today. Oh, you're in luck. We can get you in for a short appointment this afternoon at 3. Great. Thank you very much. Wow. Well, I hope you all have been enjoying the Phantasmagoria 2 stream tonight. It's been a wacky ride as usual is with this game. Yeah, very, very harvesty, uh, harvester y at this point, but, uh, you know. Will we check art today? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Uh, all right, let's see if I can do this. Uh. Hello, Curtis. What's bothering you today? Everything. <laughs> I was gonna say the exact fucking thing. Same thing as a joke. Everything. Now I can do the Batman thing? Okay, Batman thing now. Batman. And then I click on... Or... W wallet? Who are you? Batman. <laughs> What? <laughs> was that was that the Easter egg? That was the Easter egg? 
That's it. Santa Claus? That's Santa Claus. That's not Batman. There's more. Just wait. Okay. Yeah, just wait. Okay. Batman? Is that it? Is he playing? Okay. okay. I heard about Tom Ravel's murder, Curtis. Is that why you've come? Yeah. Well, that really got to me for some reason. Wait a minute. How do you know about Tom? What, is Wintech trying to check up on me or something? No, not at all, Curtis. Detective Powell came and spoke with me this morning. Uh-oh. I don't know why, but that makes me feel a little better. Do the same thing again. Uh, hmm. Anything I need to do? Uh, keep playing. You did it. It's fine. Okay, you just keep clicking. Uh, sure. All right. Curtis, I can't help you if you keep things from me. Have you been having more problems than you've told me about? Because if you're having, say, delusions or, or blackouts or hallucinations, you need to tell me right away. What is this, Doctor? Are you and Merrick trying to get me to go back to that hellhole of a nut house? Look, I got news for you. I'd rather die. Not at all. I haven't spoken to Dr. Merrick in months. I am just trying to help you get better. And you just keep clicking. Keep clicking. Right. No. Oh, yes. Okay. If I were having delusions or uh, turn up the volume a little bit for you guys. Hallucinations. What would you suggest I do? I would want to check you into a hospital for observation, Curtis. I will not go back there. I'll blow my goddamn head off first. It doesn't have to be Greenwood, Curtis. We can take you to a private facility. Shut up! You stay away from me. Patient Curtis Craig has just experienced a psychotic episode. Marked with um, severe paranoia and irrational anger. Shit. Next. Cut. <laughs> okay, Russ. That was the real one. Guys, all this time I was just playing Wesley Willis music, and guess what? Batman's ass, I whooped Batman's ass. Well, honestly, thank you, thank you for watching Phantasmagoria 2. I can't top that. What the fuck? It was real all along? It was real all along? Holy shit. Stream over! Shit. It's done. Boom. Done. <laughs> That's fucking incredible. That was fucking incredible. <laughs> uh. Batman thought he was bad. He was a fucking asshole in the first place. <laughs> okay. Well. Holy shit, someone made a procedural RPG using the Talk to Transformers style AI where you can enter commands and it generates story events? No way. Can you play it right now? Yes, it's great. Yes. Play it. Tell you what, we're gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna save the game here anyway. It's called AI Dungeon. Let's play that right now, in fact. Well, for now, I'm gonna say thank you for watching Phantasmagoria. I really can't top that ending. I just can't.
AI Dungeon. AI Dungeon 2. Let's see, is it on Steam? I can't play it here. Okay, hang on. What the fuck is this? I have to like compile it in Python or something? Am I on the right website? Um. Well, I'll tell you what. Uh, we'll be right back with AI Dungeon, but for now, let's uh, let's just call it here for Phantasmagoria. Thank you so much for watching Phantasmagoria. The game is getting really good now. I like the uh, the demon in my head. The fuck, I I sang that like the time of my life and turn it to the dead. But I sang it with a fucking demon in my head. Anyway, thank you so much for watching that that Batman shit and the taco salad. Whew. Something else. Anyway, we'll be right back with uh, AI Dungeons. So sit tight and more games coming up. Don't go nowhere. <laughs>